Do you want to learn how to turn off the RGB on Aula F75? In this video, I'm going to help solve your problem. So if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and let's get to it. So this is Aula F75. And uh, if you want to turn off this RGB on it, there are some methods to it. And the first method is you can press on the function key and the down arrow key to completely turn off the light. And you're going to see this caps lock light going to light up that basically means that it has reached the maximum potential that it can to turn off the RGB. Or if I turn it up, it's going to again light up. That means that it has reached the maximum brightness. Now, the second method of turning off the RGB would be you need to press the function key and this button that is next to the page of button. Click on it to cycle between different RGB modes. And one of them, like this one, is going to turn off the RGB completely. And if I press anything on my keyboard, there is currently no RGB on it. And the third method of turning off the RGB would be using the Aula F75 software. You can download this. I have a video on how to download this software. It's going to show up at the end of this video. There will, it will be on a playlist on the right hand side. So on the software, click on the third option, which, say, which looks like a light bulb. Then in the light effect, click on off at the bottom and then click on the floppy disk. And now the keyboard is going to react and the RGB would be turned off. So that's the three methods of doing this. And if you want to turn off this light that is next to this escape button, you can also do that. You just need to press on the function key and the left shift key on your keyboard, which is going to cycle between different light modes for this. And one of them would be to turn off this light over here. And that's it. That's how you can turn off the RGB on this keyboard, which is Aula F75. Did this video help solve your problem? Let me know with a like and comment. Also on the right hand side, you can find my other Aula F75 tutorials. So see you there. And if you have any questions, let me know in the comments.